Hi Pisces, welcome to Buddy Tarot. This is going to be your reading from the 18th to the 24th of September 2023. So let's jump right in and see what energies we have for you. So Pisces, you're showing up as the page of pentacles. You could be trying to put an effort into something, uh, you know, start over. Uh, if it's not a connection or a, a person that you're dealing with, it's just something that you're putting in effort into that could lead to something stable. Um, whether it's a project or a person, you're putting in uh, energy with the motive of bringing in stability. The energy that you're dealing with is not doing so well. There in the three of swords is a very painful energy. There's like feeling hurt and pain in everyday um, actions and um, things. You know, there's uh, there could be separation between you and somebody. Um, there could be a third party even. Uh, the mutual energy between you and this person is the wheel of fortune. So there's some changes coming about. I don't know the nature of these changes, whether this positive or negative, but definitely the wheel is turning. Now, let's look at why you're showing up as the Page of Pentacles. Why is Pisces showing up as the Page of Pentacles? So we have the Emperor, the Page of Swords, the Five of Cups, and the Sun. Empress bottom of the deck. So again, uh, you know, Pisces, this is your this is your divine counterpart who you don't want to give up on. Or at least you believe so. With the emperor and the empress here at the bottom of the deck, you and this person, you're a true match, all right? You're showing up as divine, masculine, and feminine. And, you know, definitely, uh, Pisces, um, you want to put in the effort you might be keeping a distance from this person and you're sad about the distance, but you also feel hopeful, feel like things can take a positive turn. You're positive, you're really positive, you're overflowing with positivity. Um, there's also sadness here, but that, that's, that's short-lived uh, because that's a minor arcana and your major arcana is the sun. So... Uh, you feel an energy of positivity, even though, you know, uh, you know, things might have gotten bad between you and this person. And maybe, uh, you know, a lot of water has passed under the bridge and there are some things that cannot be fixed. Um, but overall, you're showing up really positive. With the sun here. Pisces, you could be sad about a child. Like if I were to consider, like, because the emperor is a father figure, is a parent kind of energy, and the son is a child kind of energy, and there's sadness. So maybe there's something about a child or something to do with a child that you're sad about. Or if this is a like a person, like a connection, then sometimes there's sadness, but overall you feel positive about being able to start afresh and turn things to a new leaf. Now let's look at the Three of Swords. That is the energy that you're dealing with. A lot of cards flew out, so we have the Ten of Swords, the Two of Swords, and the Page of Cups. So this person that you're dealing with is, you know, you and this person are in separation. They're going through a difficult ending. They feel betrayed by you. They feel blocked. Or they could be blocking you, you know. They could be blocking you. They could be blocking this heartache. 
with the page of cups whatever feelings or desires they feel towards you or whatever whatever feelings of extending themselves towards you is coming they're blocking that as well and i feel like there's something about this ending that this person is refusing to see you know with the blindfold they're not seeing something about this ending I'm not sure what's going on with the person you're dealing with, Pisces. But it's like something is ended, something is over, and this person doesn't want to see it. There is a decision that they need to make, and they feel like they don't have enough information to make that decision. This person is waiting for their head and their heart space to align, you know. Perhaps they know how they feel emotionally, but they don't know where they're at mentally. Like, they're, they know that emotionally they want to extend themselves but mentally it's like over for them so you know this and this are not in tandem with each other because this is like starting afresh and the emotional body is focused on starting afresh but the mental body is focused on all this like ending pain blocking so it's difficult maybe that's why you have the five of cups because you're coming in with a lot of positivity and you want to put in the effort so does this person. You want to put in the effort that will stabilize. This person, maybe they are not putting in the effort, but they feel the emotions for you. With a page of swords, you are keeping tab on the situation. But this person is in a lot of pain, Pisces. They feel really betrayed and heartbroken. Perhaps that is why they are blocking whatever they are feeling. Let's look at the Wheel of Fortune, which is the mutual energy between the two of you. So for the Wheel of Fortune, we get the World, the Seven of Pentacles, the Queen of Cups, and the Chariot. So, uh, you know, a chapter has ended between you and this person. And perhaps, uh, you know, the both of you are looking at how you, how you have spent your time, effort, and energy in this cycle. Or all the effort, time, and energy that has gone into this cycle and which is coming to an end. With the Queen of Cups and the Mutual Energy, both of you feel love for each other you know this person is showing up as the page but in the mutual energy both of you are showing up as the queen so there is deep love and emotions and and there is also the chariot so you know whether you express it or whether the other person expresses it, expresses it or not definitely both of you want positive movement either out of this you know this state of mind this this painful ending that has occurred or movement out of a cycle that is closed off between the two of you you know changes are around the corner and you know the universe is bringing in changes you see that a cycle is closing off and you know irrespective of the time effort and energy that you put into a cycle it's time to move on or move in a different direction perhaps handle things differently you know but both you and this person feel deeply for each other there's love and there is positive movement either physically or energetically so pisces this is what i have for you thank you for your support and for being for being my biggest cheerleaders uh, thank you for watching sharing liking and subscribing and i will catch you again soon later bye